Mr. Mr. Mike, Larry O'Brien, it's his sight. Hit that subscribe bell. Don't forget to like it. Detroit Pistons, Pistons Mike. You know what time it is. You here for the update? Pistons Mike, keep you informed. Make sure your substrate. So you don't ever go without the info that you need. Let's see the Pistons rise. To the top. Detroit Basketball. What's What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Pastor Mike. Make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't cost you anything, not even a nickel dime. Shout out to Alice for always keeping me updated. Click the link in the description for your cool piston gear, man. Got a lot of things coming up for y'all. I'm going get, to get, get a new app um, for my clothing designs to make it more cheaper. And I'm also, you know what I'm saying, going to make my videos more better. So, yeah. But let's get into it. So... Kelly o Ke Kevin Ali, excuse me, is considered to be the most preference coach by the Detroit Pistons, which is what I know Pistons fans are going to be mad about it. But to me, this kind of makes a lot of sense. I'm going to tell you why. Kevin Ali is known, he has been a development coach. You know what I'm saying? He knows uh, Sar Thompson, hey, and you know what I'm saying, Amen Thompson. There might be, we might be targeting them, and he might be able to tell them all about it. So, um, in his up and coming draft, and not only that, he is known for developing players. That's what he's been doing at OTE, which the league is probably trash, but that don't mean nothing. He's known, Lou Will said he's known for developing young guys and can get the best out of young guys, and he's got the best out of him. And Lou Will was a sixth man. Do you know how hard it is to become a sixth man in the NBA? In the best basketball, um, you know what I'm saying, league in the world. So let's not get that misunderstood. You know what I'm saying? Kevin Ali was important to the locker room with Kevin Durant and them. So let's not get it twisted and act like this guy just doesn't have no NBA experience because he does. He's been around the NBA. He coached college basketball. He's been working his way up. So, you know, I don't really blame him because we're trying to get the most out of our young players right now. Do I expect us to go out and be on fires first year? Who knows? He did that at UConn. Can he do this with the Pistons? Probably not with this roster. Probably not. But you never know. You never really know. Um, I like I like his game. I mean, I like I like his knowledge. You know what I'm saying? I like how he talks to people. You know, he really cares about his players. So. I think that's going to, you know what I'm saying, be good for him. But we will see what happens. But he was a favorite as the insider right now. Me, if it was me, I would I, I would probably hire Monty Williams. Because before the Suns got rid of Monty Williams, he was going to adjust their um, offense. And you remember, Monty Williams don't like, don't like DeAndre Aiden. He feels like he's lazy. And he's kind of right. You know what I'm saying? He disciplined pairs when people need them the most so hey man i like him you know what i'm saying i don't mind him i don't mind either coaches i know everybody wants charles lee he's not coming here he's staying there jaron collins looks like the better hire on paper but i'm not gonna doubt troy and his experience i'm not gonna doubt him at all um i think it's perfect to rebuild our to get our players to the next level, to get our younger players to the next level, I do. I don't think Dwayne Casey was, he didn't want to do it in the first place. I think he did the best that he can, he could, but I think Kevin Ali can do a bit better than Dwayne Casey, in my humble opinion, because um, he was also a player in the league. You know, that's different. You play basketball, in the league, you know what I'm saying? I believe for 12 or 13 years for all different types of organizations. So, I mean, that's kind of hard to do, but he made it look easy, you know what I'm saying? And he stayed in the league for 12 years for a reason. So, he was a valuable locker room guy for a reason. So, it wasn't like he was just a nobody, you know what I'm saying? So, we will see what happens, but who knows? 
Um, that's a possibility. A draft lottery night is in two days. I cannot wait. I'm probably going to try to do a live stream where afterwards, right after we get our pick, I might do a live stream during it. Who knows? I'm definitely going to have the background noise turned down probably all the way because I do not want to get copyright. Uh, you know what I'm saying? They will take all of that, man, and I'm good. But it's your boy, Pinson Mike. Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. Don't cost you anything, not even a nickel or a dime. Shout out to Alice for always keeping me updated. Click the link in the description for your cool Pinson Get out of my man. Peace. Let's go. Detroit Boring. It's part of the culture. To deep base, betray you in a poster. You know the facts, so while we test the roaster, killing your haze, deadly handles our exposure, cool composure. Team stack to win the chip, act like I ain't told you. First round tick, had him sick, K Cunningham, pass John to Duncan, man. I don't know about y'all, but we come to I'm a Roger Grant, they all jumping in. Pissed in mic, we take your flight. Click like and subscribe, we can keep you right. Said the Dolphins. Our Dolphin, uh, 150 to 210 pounds, six to eight foot long. The smaller and warm water areas, because they don't have to eat as much to stay warm, and larger and cold water areas. I was in the North like Sea four summers ago. There's Jagger. Hey, Jack. The trailing edge of her pen is all scarred up. That's why we call her Jagger. She's been around a long time. Cetaceans, that's a marine mammal with a blowhole. Say adios.